I bet you didn't know armor was everywhere back then. Even simple cloth armor often saved lives. Bronze cuirasses started the long trend. Modern Kevlar vests continue that evolution. Let's sprint 3,000 years in 45 seconds. Bronze cuirasses protected torsos and organs. Leather offered flexible battlefield protection. Linen layers absorbed and dispersed impact. These pieces shielded vital organs on the battlefield. Segmented designs like Roman Lorica boosted mobility. Medieval mail traded mobility for blade protection. Full plate sacrificed flexibility for near impervious defense. 17th through 19th century firearms forced armor to shrink or vanish. World War I and World War II standardized steel helmets. Flak jackets protected troops from shrapnel. Kevlar vests emerged in the late 20th century. Ceramic plates were added to stop high-velocity rounds. These innovations made armor lighter and modular. UHMWPE plates emphasize ultra-lightweight ballistic protection. Hybrid plates combine fibers, ceramics, and composites. Focus on reducing weight for greater mobility. Focus on ergonomics for comfort and prolonged wear. Focus on multi-threat protection against bullets and shrapnel. From bronze to modern composites, armor evolved to keep people alive and moving. Please like, share, and subscribe.